I might do a bit of a speed run. This is uh, the type death by Keese chip pack from Mr. Keese. And what did we play last time? Which one are we on? I played the anaerobotic. Was that like the F version? Yes, I played this one. Next one would be the boom. I believe this would be the next one. The boom. Is that what? Uh, Fed C. Uh, we have some sort of laser artillery. Oh, that sounds cool. Well, if I'm forced to have an artillery. Uh, the boom. So let's see. Let's see what the boom is all about. Look at that. That looks like a... What superhero has purple and yellow as their colors? The lightning bolt makes me think of the Flash, but I feel like there's some superhero that that's making me think of. Who's that making me think of? Thanos is purple. Is that like a Thanos-inspired thing or something? Uh, what do we got for the boom? Federation Cruiser Type F. This top Zoltan engineer worked with the Federation to combine their artillery system with newly invented Zoltan weapon charging technology. Unfortunately, this ship is not able to have a strong weapon system without overloading the reactor. Uh-oh. We his weapons go up to level 4. Okay. We have an Artemis and a... What the hell's a defense laser mark 2? One power, one shot. Uh... With a... Breach chance and a fire chance. Interesting. Basically, there two is actually your favorite custom weapon you've made. What's going on with that? Just a. I'm confused. Uh, basic laser. Does basic laser have a fire chance on it? So does this just add breach chance? And oh, it's a whole laser. It does double damage on systemless rooms. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> that's weird. All right, we have the normal one power, two damage Artemis. And the laser artillery is a slow, high-powered, seven-shot laser weapon. More power means faster cooldown. You really went all out to make the player want to upgrade the artillery, looks like. There's a one-shot hole smasher, basically. Okay, that is pretty interesting. What's a Zoltan overcharger? Cooldown between weapon shots is improved by 50%. So is this a better automated reloader? Yeah, automated reloader affects artillery, so... Okay, it looks like this might be one of the few ships where... You gotta check out Gibbs. Father of Ion! Nice. Really clean. Really clean. Uh, we do them twice when they look good like that. Father of Ion! This might be one of the few ships where I actually ignore my weapons and upgrade artillery. Which is, I have a feeling, the as-intended version of this ship. Um, get rock on... Do I keep you on weapons? Although I might do one weapon upgrade so I can have both these available and then start investing, but second shield first, of course. Wow, look at this ship layout. We got two hallways. That's the first time I've seen that on a fed ship. That is interesting. That is a very interesting layout. Let's go artillery number one. <laughs> I'm on normal. Ah, oh, crap. Hanger, sorry. Thank you for reminding me. I completely forgot. I didn't even think about that. We play on hard mode. Unless we're on uh, multiverse, but okay. Thank you. I was it's totally not because I wanted to avoid that solar flare or pulsar or whatever that was. Weapons can't go above fourth level. We are pretty much dependent on artillery, yeah. Attempt to follow. I like free crew. Um, let's put you on engines so the Zoltan can be on shields. What's the basic laser too? It's basically a whole laser with only one shot. That's how I would describe it. Okay. Um... Man, what's the artillery's cooldown though? Is this true 50 seconds or is it this fucking fucker game? <laughs> is it faster than that? I'm gonna I'm gonna let this go. It's a it's a full true 50 second cooldown, isn't it? Okay. 
That's your favorite curse. Let it fly. <laughs> cool. It's got the sound and look of a heavy laser, kind of. Should have shot shields there. Rock is going to have quite a pilgrimage to the med bay whenever he gets hurt. God, I hope he never gets hurt. Because you're right, that will take a while. Okay, if we go a little late today, it's perfectly fine. I've been ending early on my hard mode no pause days, so if we go a little bit longer. Definitely okay. Especially since I might not even be able to go out and work out today because of the ice. I'm not sure if the uh, workout place I go to will even be open. Yeah, it's basically the boss phase 3 artillery, right? That's what I'm seeing. It's true, the augment does make it faster, so it's 25 seconds, I guess? Is this 50 second description correct? I guess would be the question. Alright, before I do anything, I want shields so we can have safe fights. I'll probably skip the store because I don't think we want to sell anything here. Damn it, running. Don't hack my weapons. He yeah, hacked the artillery. Freaking hell. Fuck you, FTL. Fucking hell, man. <laughs> Alright. No dodges. Is it totally frozen over? It's not too bad. But we're in Dallas, so if there's one inch of snow, things shut down. And that was what our forecast was today. One inch of snow. Which means... I didn't leave my apartment and I have no idea what's open. I just have no idea if, if stuff shut down a lot or not. You both had the same idea for how to make an artillery worth using, make it overpowered. Yeah, you kind of have to overbuff artillery to make it even semi-usable. A lot of viewer ships try to play around artillery and a lot of them fail at making it worth investing in. This one looks like it's going to be worth investing in though. Jesus, two ships in a row with hacking. The ice seems pretty melted by you, Zach Dog. I'm hoping it is here too. What the hell, man? What the actual fuck? So I'm hoping things are open when I drive later. At least they didn't hack my weapons either time, so I'm happy about that. Nice. Okay. You used to live on the west coast, it was the same in Montreal now though, and they close here for no weather. <laughs> yeah. How much do you love artillery? Only two of yours have had it. And it's a Vulcan and Burst Laser 3 respectively, yeah. Um, we have seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, something like that. Your uh, artillery does six hole damage and system damage. Breaches and pierces two shield layers. Okay. I kind of need my missiles, actually. I'm not going to do that deal, which I would normally do. Disrupt my shields. Well, shit. Oh, this is insane, man. Doesn't matter what version of FTL you play, if you get this fucking event, there is no goddamn counterplay if it's before you have 30 fucking scrap, or 50 scrap to upgrade your defenses. F you, Fuck FTL. You, All right, FTL. good. Fuck you. Only like three damage from this bullshit event. Dumbest event in the game, literally. Literally the cheapest, most stupid BS event in the game. Thank you for fast firing Artemis, keeping us there. Okay, now we can get shields right after when we needed them to not die to that bullshit event. Fine, whatever. Now we need power. Um, uh, anyone remember RPG Nerdo's semi-aimable artillery, the one that spawned a crew member you could aim the damage? I vaguely remember that. Damn, and now my only choice is store. I shouldn't have spent that scrap. I just. Get it. 
point is to go to a store with horse crap. Rock into piloting? Why? I mean, I want rock where he can put out fires, and where's the most important place for him to put out fires? My opinion is weapons, so... Slug is the only crew I really want to get into wep uh, piloting as, as soon as possible. I'm gonna grab Clone Bay, if anything, for the sake of that poor rock and weapon room. I wanna save missiles now. Uh, new more iconic combo RPG and special gimmicks that spawn crew. <laughs> well said, well said. I love those gimmicks. Oh man. It's the only one I would seriously consider, but no, I want high scrap. Can't do it. Can't do it. It's guaranteed high scrap. Oof, what a good reward, too. Now I go to the store. Now I go to the store to sell that. It's almost as iconic as your clone bay image going out of the clone bay room. <laughs> Holy weapons, Batman. Oh my god. Um, if I am forced to have a four power weapon system, you know what I'd like? Black heavy laser, basic laser, Artemis. Maybe not the basic laser and the Artemis, but definitely the flak heavy laser. Holy crap. I want both of those. How much to get both of those? 115. Damn, I can only get one. Um, I guess the artillery does an admirable job of getting through shields anyway, so let's just buy the heavy laser. I really wanted that flak, though. I know, that is one hell of a store, isn't it? Yeah, we're not selling the overcharger. 50% faster on everything is insane. Or, I guess that would be 100% faster, right? No, I don't know. Math, percentages, it's a lot faster. Weapons charge in half the time or something. Man, if only I could have sold that at the store, that might have let me get the flak. Wow, Zoltan or Zoltan. So many choices. I guess I'll go Zoltan. Be 100% more speed, 50% less cooldown. There you go. Charge is 100% faster, yeah. I think that makes sense. I know, more math. Why are you indoors? I don't... Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that, that, one, that one might be my favorite. That one cracks me up. Oh, Rock's taking damage. It's gonna take an, an hour to heal. Yeah, get over and help, I guess. Nice. That one's your second favorite. <laughs> it's pretty good. It's pretty good. No empty rooms for me to shoot, so no bonus basic laser value. Well, it looks like everybody's going to have to heal now, so it's fine. The augment from a few ships ago was not minus 92% shield charge time, but plus 1100 charge speed. Okay. That uh, that soundbite depicts the meaningless of life with such attention to detail. <laughs> wow, wow. <laughs> yeah. It's like they ported that border specifically to the rock to know you and make him do a pilgrimage, yeah. Someone asked about the augment timing. Oh, okay. Alright, what I really need is power. But I also want to see what's at the store, because what if there's another flak one? So I'm going to be really greedy before going to the store. Oh, Zoltan Border Police. Okay. Um... Do 
Get the Zelton border, please, man. At least we're safe from crew damage. Cool. That's very good. Or, yeah, they, their weapons suck, basically, is what I'm trying to say. Basically, your weapons are pieces of garbage, and I'm glad you have them. Thank you for having garbage weapons. Beautiful. Okay. And we don't even need to use any uh, missiles here. You at least get a free trial and Zeltan Sector's my ace. What? Wish we could buy a mining cart for the rock. <laughs> mining cart. I can get around this sector faster. I could train, but... Oh, value point shields. Of course he does. I uh, don't want to take the time. And we can't speed hack our way through hyperspace, sadly. Cannot speed hack our way through hyperspace. Well, that was not a very good reward for you to get free three borders on my ship. Okay. For how fair Zoltans are supposed to be and peaceful, they sure are trigger happy. No kidding. All right. Um, I'm getting hack and cloaking, right? Yeah. Yeah, we'll go ahead and do that. I didn't get nearly as much scrap as I was hoping for this store. Maybe it'll be a crappy store and I won't want anything. They have hacking. I have to sell a weapon to get hacking, so I'm not going to do that. So let's get power and a weapon. So now I can have basic plus heavy. Okay. Alright, can you do damage? Yes. Okay, my <laughs> drone just blocked with his face. Well done. Well done, face tanking. Alright, I need one more power and then I can have all my stuff online and not feel like I'm missing power. So I doubt I'll do another weapon upgrade. Once I get power, I think I'm going to start looking into... Actually upgrading this artillery, that is not useless. Although, these three one-power weapons together are not terrible. Artemis into shields and basic laser, heavy laser into weapons or something, so... We have seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, okay. Oh, do, 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 leave. And I forgot to refresh my crew. I mean, not refresh, but heal day my crew. Yeah, I might, I might try to not dally on this run, just so we don't go too late. I don't want to go super late if I can help it. I wonder how quickly this guy's going to level weapons. It's pretty fast. Not bad. With the artillery counting as weapon training. Oh, man. Why do you keep having stores in my way? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I'll just... Let's go around. We can't do seven. We can only do six. I don't think anyone minds how late we go, except me. <laughs> I meant for me. I'm sure you all would love for me to go super late. Well, now I might go to the store. You keep giving me good stuff to sell. I guess I could buy fuel. You're the streamer. Dance, monkey. All right. Dancing. Um. Oh, man. Apparently, I get a bonus Zoltan Border Police with my Zoltan Border Police. And this guy can actually do damage through my two shields, which I am not super psyched about. 
Uh, you know, what I'm going to do is I'm going to let them come through here because then they'll go to the heal bay once they make their way through. Oh, wow, that artillery is something. Holy free fire, me. <laughs> Holy free fire. The quadruple reward. Remember the other day I said I hardly ever see quadruple rewards? That right there is a quadruple reward. We got stuff plus a drone and stuff plus a weapon. Holy shnikes, what a reward. That is a jackpot. All right, I'll take free borders if it means I get a quadruple reward, man. Holy shnikes. I got a side of border police with your order, double border police. How nice. <laughs> well, if they reward me like that, I'll take it. Then I'm definitely going to store because we got stuff to sell. All right. Can I afford hacking? Yes, I can. I was going to upgrade my artillery, but hacking, though, but hacking. And we got to sell fire beam because that looks like a way to make boss fight phase one. Um, crew killing a lot better. I will say, since we're getting hacking cloaking with artillery and no teleporter, crew killing phase one is going to be important with no mind control counter. So if I find a slug to put on piling, that would be very helpful. Okay. Hey, it's a beam master. What are we looking at for crew killing here? Three humans and a heal bay. Who knows? If I can uh, do this right. I have a feeling this artillery is going to do far too much hull damage. Although shields are burned down, so maybe. Maybe, maybe. I hacked heal bay. Well, let's see here. I tell you, even when artillery is good, it sucks. It just ruined our crew kill. Damn it. Ah, damn you, artillery. I think we had that if I was not dumb and forgot to turn that back off. Uh, yeah, I like that deal. NG. Yeah. Thanks for helping, artillery. Thanks. Yeah, they're just pirates. Wait, fire beam doesn't count as carefully got the ship out, apparently. <laughs> I was going to help you by carefully cutting your ship out with my fire beam. What do you mean you don't want that kind of help? Now this guy's got two shields in sector two? No, this is the first ship in sector three, isn't it? Okay. I guess I can get weapon training while I wait for the thing. All right, artillery, I'm going to need you to do good work here. I think we're getting hit by this missile. Oh my god. Artillery doesn't fire before the missile? Okay, it barely does. Come on. Come on. Got it! Ooh, that was close. That was close. Oh, damn it. Uh, All right, I kind of need power. Damn, they keep showing me all the stores, though. Power. And next is either a weapon upgrade or artillery or something. I want to upgrade the artillery, but... Yes, yeah, sell all of my... Uh, yeah, I'm not going to use Artemis for a while, so that's good. 
puts me puts me a little ahead in scrap. So I need to go to the store just to buy fuel, I think, though. From what you see, artillery hits do one damage per hit, but they do have a chance of breach. Does it tell us? Yeah, it doesn't actually tell us, so... Um, what are the... They have a 10% for fire and breach, is what Mr. Key says. Okay. Alright. You don't remember exactly, but you think it's something like that? Okay. Alright. Buy all the fuel. Do I need to go to the other store for fuel? Nah, I'll skip it. With both fire and breach, though, it's pretty solid. Yeah, for sure. Can't do giant alien spiders. No blue options for that. Mm. I'm going to do the weapon upgrade first. Because I'd like to have the option of basic laser plus fire beam. Or heavy laser plus fire beam, whatever. So, I'm going to do that plus power first, and then we'll do artillery next, probably. The fire and breach chance is the only thing differentiating this artillery from a flak artillery. And also projectile speed. Yeah. This is a Hermes. This one does get off before artillery. Damn, punish for not. Um, well, maybe I can use a missile here. Punished for not upgrading our artillery, it seems. Oh, missile hit, missile hit. Oh, fuck you, game. God damn it. Rewarded for upgrading our weapons. That's what I meant to say. Okay. There we go. Artillery level two. Uh, Rand or anyone here, have you been playing WoW Hardcore with other folks? Have you been running dungeons? I I have only played on stream, and I've only been soloing so far. I hope to do dungeons eventually, but nobody in chat has joined me in game yet. But I think some people in chat might have been playing on their own, so... Uh, we might eventually get a group together to do some dungeons. I'd be down with that. Uh, it will require people to be on. I think it's Skull Rock that we're on and be at the same level. I'm currently level 21. Wish we could command it to fire. It's ridiculous that we can't aside from unpowering it. Yeah. Even if it's just a toggle to say fire when ready or or not. You'd be super down to run with you, but you're on Defias Pillager. You'll try to level a character to catch up. All right. It's a free weapon. All right. Uh, I stream on Wednesdays and Fridays, so I guess the other issue would be if you can play when I'm streaming. Be it too powerful a feel if you had full control. You should be able to fire it on command at least. Uh, human gets me a Mantis here. Welcome aboard, Agent Smith. Beautiful. Any training? No, so be on doors. But it's like this time... Well, this would be the end of the stream that we go to on uh, Wednesdays and Fridays, about 50 minutes from now. Okay. Mm. Use one missile. Okay. I am pretty missile starved with having sold so many. Look at human being useful. The one blue option in the game for humans. We can now get rid of them. <laughs> Served his purpose, got us a non human. All right, what's my next goal? Level 2 hacking and power, probably. The next sector, Rebel or Mantis, Sector 4. 
Uh, how well do I deal with Mantis Borders? I feel like the venting on this ship is... How is it? It's not bad, actually. Can kind of vent them towards the heel bay, so I could probably deal with Mantis Borders. I'd rather deal with that than Rebel Riggers and Rebel Disruptors. Yeah. We have a quest and a distress. Let's go ahead and do the hacking too. Don't quite have the power for it yet. Might want to go for some crew kills in this sector with fire beam against Mantis. Oh, rock ship. Okay, well, at least we don't have to fight the rock ship. Your work is flexible. You could definitely try to get a Wednesday or Friday free. We'll message in game, but good luck. You're so glad to see you playing it. You thought I'd like it. Yeah, I've been having a good time with it. Um. I've been enjoying my hardcore classic playthrough for sure. You on doors, you on sensors. Alright, low on fuel, as usual. Feels like every run lately we've just been running out of fuel. Well, I guess the second run today, the multiverse run, we had plenty of fuel. They're just pirates. Okay, he, I was going to say can't damage us, but that can damage us. thought that was a heavy ion. Fuck you, FTL. Fuck your Should've... shitty fucking bullshit. Cheating ass motherfucker bullshit game. Okay, alright, alright, Pass Ran. That was... I guess that was my own missile. I was like, why did I go off so much when they just hit me with a beam drone? <laughs> Because that was me as the enemy being pissed off. Okay. That was your third favorite. <laughs> that one I'm a little embarrassed about. Okay. All right, Pass Ran. Give it. It's not. Come on. It's not the end of the world. It's only a game. Watch the profanity. Okay. I do. I do need the fuel. I do need the fuel. Four fuel was like minimum fuel deal I would have taken. Holy free stuff. All right. There's our stores. They're, it's an NG um, mall in this Mantis sector. We do have stuff to sell. Do I want to check both stores? Plus for 25, plus 95. I'd have to sell three things to get cloaking, so I think I'm only going to go to one store. I love how you try and soft censor yourself normally, but it all goes completely out the window when I get salty. It does. It really does. It's like, I still have my... A little bit of my religious upbringing as a child where I'm like, I shouldn't say these words. And then when I get mad, like, I just can't stop myself. Alright, I think I am going to sell the Artemis to get the Ion Stunner. This is like a really cheap way to upgrade my offense right now. That's probably not worth, but uh, I like it. I like it. Long range scanner is always a good pickup. Salt needs to be shared. <laughs> okay. Oh, God. Oh, God. Everything turns red as the mantis arrive. Quadruple mantis. Okay, let's get uh, prepared to deal with these guys. This guy make his long trek over here. Oh. Come on in. Do I have an NG? I don't have an NG for repairing. Okay. Um, demand to see FTL's manager. What is that? Is that me as a Karen or something? The walk of shame or glory for this rock running across the entire ship? We'll, we'll call it uh, 
the walk of glory. The you better get out of his way, because when he gets there, he's gonna beat you down. He he walks slowly to give his enemies a chance to run away in fear. Portal 2 Lemon Rant, but it's FTL missiles, huh? Somebody said that that reminded them of... Apparently there's a scene in... Uh, National Lampoon's Vacation where Chevy Chase's characters just starts ranting and they, they posted the link and I was like, you know, that is... He doesn't do it with such bad language, quite as bad language, but that is kind of what... I'm doing. It is kind of has some similarity. Yeah, but that, no dodges for me, I guess, there. What's his name? Something Grimwald. Uh, I don't think I've ever actually watched... Uh, no, it's the Christmas one. Christmas Vacation, I guess it is. I don't think I've ever watched it all the way through. I always forget his name. Portal 2 Lemon Rant, but uh, I don't know if I remember the Portal 2 Lemon Rant. I assume it's the, the robot talking to you. And goes off about lemons or something, but I don't remember that. Sun, sun... So many solar flares. Right, let me get one more power. Keep wanting to save up for cloaking, but it's one more power. Just one more power. Oh, okay. You just you just copy pasted it. All right. Oh, they just gave me power after I bought power. Okay, I'll read that in a second here. Um, I've been thinking, when life gives you lemons, don't make lemonade. Make life take the lemons back. Get mad. I don't want your damn lemons. What am I supposed to do with these? Demand to see life's manager. Make life rue the day it thought it could give Cave Johnson lemons. You know who I am? I'm the man who's going to burn your house down with the lemons. Okay. <laughs> Maybe I vaguely remember that. Pretty funny. Pretty funny. I knew he was going to take out my doors. I freaking knew it. See it coming. That was the wrong way. Holy crap. Let's get pelted by lasers, man. This is definitely a pew pewening. A lot of pew pewnage going on this run. I'm going to get my engineers to build a combustible lemon that burns your house down. Okay. Add more F-bombs, swap lemons for missiles, and we have past Rand in all his glory. <laughs> okay. Sounds about right. Okay. We're getting close to that cloaking. Mmm, sun... Man, it's, I keep trying to avoid the solar flares. They're like, no, no, you have to go into a solar flare if you want to get all your jumps. All right. I guess I'll go to a solar flare. Big giant missile. Hack the weapons. Okay, looks like I didn't need that. It's fine. Alright, so I was about to fight him. <laughs> he left. You pansy. I just did my weapons backwards, actually. Okay, we didn't take damage. And instantly ventable rooms. I approve. Alright, we can definitely get cloaking now. So that's our goal next sector. Find a store, buy cloaking, dot 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 profit. Rand has outsourced his saltiness to past Rand. That's how I do it. Can't do giant alien spiders. Sad. Although sometimes past Rand and present Rand unite. Become salty Rand. 
That is a three shield ship. All right, let's hack their shields. Hey, Rackagak with the the raid. Welcome, raiders. How are you doing, Rackagak? Good to see you, my friend. Appreciate that raid. Hope you had a good stream. Becomes a salt composite of Rand in all his many forms, yeah. That's a lot of fires. That is a lot of fires. And not even a fire beam was fired. That's definitely the artillery having some sort of fire chance there. Alright, enough for hacking. I mean cloaking. Slugger NG. NG has more... Well, they both have two to three stores, actually. And... Slug has potential for more scrap, but I am at low on fuel. But Slug also lets me potentially have Civilian and Zoltan and be able to go around the Zoltans. Let's go Slug. You're doing well. You won Mantis B and Lane is A and now on a 19 streak. Grats. Awesome. You're doing... You're doing... Have you completed the cycle once before? I feel like you have. Are you one of those few crazy people who's actually done the cycle? Successfully, one time? I feel like I heard that you had done that. These three shields, double missiles, free borders, Jesus Christ, this event. Uh... I really hate this event. This is the uh, worrying radiation event. Man, artillery, I need you to do some work. Oh wow, Island Stunner by itself? With the... Uh... Oh, that's pretty awesome actually. With the augment we have, it actually fires fast enough. To keep shields down. Come on, get that missile down. This could be really bad if he hits me in piloting here. Come on, dodge. Come on, dodge. Okay, it's not hitting my weapons. Fuck this fucking fucker game. God damn it. Okay. Ah, oh, this fucking sucks, actually. Um, his next missile hits me unless my hacking's up in time. Where it burns down. Please burn. Nice! Beautiful. What an insane first fight for Sector 4. Three shields, double missiles, three borders, burst laser 2. This is about the worst possible build I could think of for... For this stupid bullshit cheating event. It's about as overpowered as this event could be right there. It's insane. Uh, you have one 31 no pause cycle. You have another on iOS. iOS is the... You did the iPad... Uh, thing? Were you the one who did the iPad... Um, cycle? Because that's insane. Them angry missiles this run? Yeah, no kidding. Right, I was hoping for a store up there. Neozara maybe as well. Well, you are you you are both crazy because I have heard how hard that is. <laughs> I have heard how difficult it is to do that. Damn it! If that's a store, would I backtrack for it? I would, cause I get cloaking and buy fuel. It'd be really inefficient. But efficiency is what wins the run. Double frickin' bombs! Holy crap! How about every ship has? All of the consumables and none of the downsides. So, hashtag balanced. Do, 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 
Might have been a crew kill, but I'm so pissed off about all these missiles that I'm not even caring. Go for crew kills. All right, we got two fuel. Thank goodness. All right, that helps. No store there. Okay. All right. Um, uh, banking a lot of scrap. Dodge. Go dodge. Pa uh, maybe not need the power yet. Yeah, I don't need the power yet. I don't want to spend too much, because what if there's cloaking and backup battery in the store? I don't know the YouTube comment about how I I um, bank too much scrap to save for cloaking. And I understand people saying that, but like... To me... I don't know. Like, I, I feel like I bank a lot of scrap, but I could get the crew kill here, but I'm not patient enough. I don't know. It's a balancing act in hard mode, no pause. Like, if you say you need to spend more scrap to not die, but then you spend so much that you can't afford cloaking, like, that's... I don't know. It's, it's a line you have to ride, and I feel like... Some folks, when they make those recommendations, I mean, when I go to a store, if I spent more scrap right now, so I had just enough for cloaking, I couldn't buy repairs, I couldn't buy fuel. Like, it's not only cloaking I'd need from a store. So, I don't know, I guess I'm preemptively defending myself against more suggestions on how I play FTL or something, I don't know. Okay, weapons suck, no cloaking. All right, well, this is not ideal. This is not the store I wanted. Uh, slow, slug pilot is is useful, though. Damn, if I get the slug pilot, I don't afford cloaking. Unless I sell something. Your philosophy when trying to get cloaking is to sometimes... Rent gear like okay weapons, sell up to cloaking later when your offense is stronger. That's a pilot train slug, I'm gonna do it. Now I have to decide if I even go to the store. I'd have to sell I'd have to sell fire beam heavy laser. I could sell long range scanners and one on the ion stunner, and I can get cloaking. Probably would be worth. Let me actually see if I can go one, two. If I can, I'd backtrack for that. Because I also kind of need the fuel. Did I buy all the fuel from the store? I think I did. God. These freaking weapons. These freaking weapons, man. You float 80 to 100 scrap and usually sell up to cloaking. The rest you try to use to upgrade your ship unless you're in a dangerous sector or in a very scary situation. Fuck you, game. Zero fucking dodges. Still zero fucking dodges. One chain laser dodge. Completely worthless. Slows down my artillery. Is he gonna cloak at the exact time that my artillery goes uh, charges? I bet. I bet you it's gonna do that crap. Okay, good. I actually should have depowered artillery right as that was about to charge if that was gonna happen, which I think I would have done. But I don't have enough power, as usual. Damn, and my hacking was just not quite ready in time. Fucking hell, man. I get a goddamn dodge to save my life. I 
Meanwhile, he dodges 50% of my shots. If you're a bad spot, you just make upgrades to survive? Yeah. Yeah, it makes sense. That's what I try to do, but it sounds like maybe I spend less crap than some other people. I don't know. Damn, I can't get that. And there was no more fuel, so there's no reason to go to the store. Ah, uh, three fuel. I'm like, what right now? What upgrade helps me stay alive? Maybe, maybe I do another artillery upgrade actually. Because I'm kind of relying on that to get through shields for my we fast firing weapons. Do I have enough to sell? That's for 25. Yeah, okay. So this artillery is basically my weapon upgrade. I think that means 30 seconds means 15 with the augment we have, I believe. So you get three shields if you can sell the cloaking. Well, the shields are so much more expensive than any other upgrade. That's why I didn't do it. All right, Abadoth. Scan for life forms. Abadoth. No fuel. Thank God for a store. Okay. Okay. Watch this store have three fuel. Six fuel. Okay. All right. I need all of it. Okay. And could be a dive, but I don't. One, two, three. I don't want to dive with only six fuel. You'd also very much say it also very much depends if you just left the store and looking for scrap or if you are just trying to find a store ASAP. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. One of those things where, like most things in FTL, it depends on your situation. And I probably oversimplify some people's YouTube comments too when I say they say just do this. This uh, artillery being much faster is very nice. Still doesn't get the missile offline though, so that's not ideal. Dodges, man, the dodges. No surrender. Fuck you, FTL. Fucking hell, man. I agree, Fast Rand. I agree. Ho oh, ho ho! Deleted that slug. Get deleted. Get deleted. What's up, Turbo Jet? You were on site when I started, but you were AFK, so you couldn't join in. Guess I'll see the whole thing on YouTube. Yeah, it'll be on YouTube tomorrow. We even had a multiverse run today. That was surprisingly less annoying than I was expecting it to be <laughs> with my past uh, multiverse experiences. I know, get wrecked, slime bag. All right, I would like to get their shield. Let's see if we have, oh my God, Zoltan or Zoltan, those are my choices. All right, let's see if we have uh, an early store. If I don't see an early store, I might get shields or work towards it. My first jump is a jump I have to backtrack, backtrack through. If this doesn't have cloaking, I'm gonna be so frustrated. Okay, at least it made the, the jump worth it. Okay. sector are we in? Is this seven? No, it's six. So I need to buy all the fuel. Two repairs. And that right there is in my defense. Well, I feel like my saving works for me. Like if I had spent more than I had, I, you could argue I had 190 scrap. I should have spent more scrap. Well, if I had spent more scrap, I could not have gotten all of the fuel at the store and the cloaking and a couple repair. So that's like, that's, that's my, 
results-based analysis saying I saved the right amount of scrap, basically. What's the sound where you're like zero effing dodge or something? You like that one? <laughs> yeah. Classic, classic. If only you'd been able to stay awake for another 40 minutes, you would have been able to collect cookies for the whole time. Oh. Zero effing dodge is just one art piece in a formidable collection of Rand creations. <laughs> well said. 69 scrap, the best man scrap. All right, now we actually do want to get shields, though. Although I need power for days, but shields is our next upgrade. That's a lot of burst lasers, but I do have cloaking. I do need backup battery, though, because our power situation is not ideal. No, not you. Don't leave. Why am I not using hacking? I'm not sure. Good dodges. Uh, no, no. Oh, there it is. Yep, that is the thing. Beautiful. Beautiful. Killer just did work. This is crazy. The Ion Stunner with... Um... With this augment that makes things 50% faster, basically turns an Ion Stunner... Wow, what a deal. Into an Ion Blast Mark II for one power, which is insane. This augment is insane. This makes our 8 second Ion... 10 second Ion Stunner into every 5 seconds, which is a, a 1 power 5 second... Ion Blast that guaranteed stuns. That's pretty crazy. Yeah, and it stuns. You're really sad that I only play viewership on ships on Mondays? Uh, you're sad that I play the viewerships or that I don't play it more often? Store. Uh, if I go one, two, three, I think I get that. Kind of seems like no matter what, what I do on which days, people are like, I wish you did this on this days, or... I wish you played more hard mode, no pause. Or I wish you played more of the non-FTL days. Yeah, it's 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 hard. I I do I do what I do because I'm trying to balance viewership with my own enjoyment with variety, you know? So Yeah, that's level three cloaking. God damn it. A missed shot just killed my fucking drone. Wow, FTL. Just wow. If I try to find a balance of me having fun, chat having fun, and decent viewership. I hate this fucking game. I just fired... Five, six, seven projectiles against one shield and hit nothing. Unfucking believable. At least we can cloak his ass. Okay. Uh, Harmonopause isn't your favorite type of run, to be honest. Well, my viewership shows it as by far my most popular viewership, so that's why I give it two days a week. I am a slave to the algorithm a bit. But I also, if I was a true slave to the algorithm, I wouldn't play anything but Harmonopause. And we all know how my sanity is, does with that, so it's a balance. FTL viewership day is my day to recover from Arma no pause. And then the other days when I play no FTL is my day to recover from all of the FTL stuff. So. Can't please every single person on the internet. Big surprise. But I do like anytime you're able to hang out. Jesus, these dodges are insane, man. That's why you hate, why you hate not having actual beams. 
If you're invested in RAN, then the cycle for sure, yeah. Nice that you do try to balance. You've seen too many streamers that just do plays. Just play stuff that's popular to please the audience. Don't enjoy it themselves, which gets stale real fast. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's it really is a balancing act when you stream. If you want to do it for a living, you got to find that balance of what you enjoy versus what people like to watch versus what, you know, is sustainable. So. Uh, true slaving to the algorithm is making five to ten shorts. YouTube shorts from every video, I guess so, yeah. So running away. Um, let's go do a piloting hack, I guess, here. Nice. Beautiful. Breach piling is perfect. Uh, on the contrary, you prefer to watch people play something they genuinely have fun with, even if it's not the game of the year, made by AAA Studios or whatever. Yeah. Well, and personally, what I like to watch is I like to watch people who are the best at what they do. Sometimes I like to watch entertaining stuff, but when I'm not streaming or watching stuff about MMOs I'm looking forward to, the reason I watch League is because I like to watch people who are like the best at the world at what they do. So that's 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 kind of my thing. I like to see people who are really good at the games they play. Actually, I dive if I go through this door, don't I? It's a dive, but it's a cloaking dive and it gets me a store. Yeah, I'm gonna take the dive. Uh, you find a lot of time with streamers that you enjoy watching just their content. Like one guy was great and he even watched him play Elden Ring and that game is awful. <laughs> oh, there's heavy laser. Okay, so this could be my four power weapon system when I'm not using fire beam. I think I like that. So this is my four power weapon system. I get shields, I get weapons, I get power. There's no backup battery here, is there? No. I cannot find backup battery to save my life. Okay. Let's get the weapon upgrade, shield upgrade, and some power here. There we go. Four OP, um, one power weapons with cloaking and hacking support. Can I buy any repairs or fuel? No, okay. Obligatory flattery. You like to watch Rand, for example, you can't say you're all that much into WoW, but it's still fun to hang around and watch you trounce mobs and drop a few salt jokes. Yeah. It's a good time. Definitely a good time. You mainly watch people who are very good at the games they play as well. You can respect people who don't like to watch Uber Sweats. Uber Sweats. What is... Oh, is that people who try... Like, is that the try hard people? Saying people are sweaty means they're trying really hard, right? Oh my god, it's five fucking borders. Alright, hack the damn weapons. Okay, at least his weapons suck. Holy shit, five goddamn mantis borders. Uh, okay, everybody on board here. Okay, there. Holy fucking, what the, why did you guys move? Uh, there's no, okay, I could hack, no, I can't hack teleport because I already hacked weapons. Okay, I might even need the Zoltan over here, actually. Okay, uh, thank god we I'm playing with pause right now. Get the F off my damn ship. 
This has not been an easy run with boarding, man. We had that Zoltan, uh... The slug, whatever, earlier, too. The uh, slug, whatever the hell it's called. I can't think of words right now. The worrying radiation event. That's the word I'm trying to think of. Okay, I think we've dealt. I think we're good. Okay. Holy shnikes. Inf that was one infestation? Yeah, that was a bad infestation. Get exterminated. Alright, time to repair and heal and stuff. Um... Uh... Let's see here. You watch a lot of Hitman streams too, and you find the ones that are the best of the best very boring because they just win. It's more fun when there's contests like Rand versus Cyclops of Chibit, not a walk in the park. Read about Hitman watching Hitman by Rand was fun enough for you. Uh, to go grab it and try it myself. It's a rare occasion. You may have designed the latest of the Mantis flagship, but it has some major cheese, all of which is intended. Okay. All right, I like cheese on my viewerships. Five Mantis boarding events are why I'm sometimes weary of Mantis sector with certain crew compositions, yeah. What beam is that one? I don't have a beam. Uh, we have an artillery that's seven laser shots, though. Your screen is glowing purple, that's just the viewership. Yep, yep it is. Okay, um. All right, I need power for days. Can't get back a battery. <laughs> Immense flagship is an enemy ship, not a player ship. Oh my god. Okay. I'm not sure if I am exci as excited about that then. Alright, extra free crew is good, even if it's a human. I feel like I have an infestation of my own. Three humans. Three humans does an infestation create, become something. All right, about time to dive. The basic laser two is just one whole laser one shot. That's correct. That is correct. Yes. Triple defense drones with three shields. Okay. Um. I'm hacking this drone control here. What I'm gonna do is only fire it. Right as our, right as our volley goes off. Or only activate it right as the uh, giant volley is incoming. Get blasted, sir. Get blasted, nice, nice. Pop, pop. Heavy laser doing work. Um, do we have another body thing? Is shorts worthy? What body? What body thing? If you think, if you see something on my stream that you want, that you think would be a good YouTube short, please clip it and then send me a message. Because I would like to start doing the YouTube clip thing because it seems like it's pretty popular. And they're really easy for me to make if I just have the, the link to the clip. It's super easy. So, here's your Rand stream request. If you see something you think is clip worthy, clip it and send me either a message or uh, you whisper or something about it. Okay. Um, do this. And again, thank you to Zach Dog for even suggesting that we start doing that because I'm tell terrible at all that social media stuff, so I wouldn't have even thought to start doing that, even though I have literally watched a bunch of clips from other streamers and things. Nice double fire. Poking is... Now, beautiful. Get blasted. Thank you for boarding in the heal bay. Appreciate that about you, stupid humans. Man, do we even uh, get the kill before 
ASB. Fires again? Looks like no. I'm gonna see if I dodge it though. For score farming shenanigans. Nice! All right, get farmed for score. Board, uh, dive ship, get farmed. Also, I want your fuel, so that's why the other excuse to kill that guy off. NG or Zoltan? No thanks, Zoltan 7. It's flak artillery, but lasers which move faster and can't be shot by defense drone 1. Yeah, pretty much. Just realized you have a level 1 hype train sitting at the top of chat for like 5 plus hours. <laughs> that's funny. Uh, store for backup battery. Yeah, that's about the last thing we need. Uh, in the meantime, we're going to work on a cursed spit to make it less unplayable. Okay, I was hoping that was going to get me scrap so I could check the store for backup battery. I don't want to sell anything. Everything I have, I like. Well... Alright, if I can't get a backup battery, a free power from a quest is not too shabby either. First spite. Oh. Is that one of your ships that we played at some point, Turbojet? I have a hard time remembering ships by their name, unless it's extremely descriptive, descriptive like the flagship that is just a flak shooting things. Uh, auto hacker missiles. I keep hitting B to add more power, and I don't have any power. I don't have any backup battery. Well, I was waiting for the burst laser 2 to go off, but for some reason this missile is so much faster. I couldn't, I couldn't cloak the entire thing. It's fine, it's fine. Auto fire that. You're working on it. It has basically nothing going for it other than a teleporter, med bay, and clone bay. Okay. God, this weapon hack is annoying as an F. Who knows? Maybe let's get, a, maybe let's get us some dodge training then. Hey, speaking of which, there's the dodge training. Beautiful. No art of any kind for that ship, though? Okay. Uh, 38 scrap. Double reward. Beautiful. May I please have backup battery? Please, store. Please have backup battery. It's kind of the only thing I need from the store. Well, we could go Vulcan with this only four power weapons allowed. Is that better? Doesn't feel better. It doesn't feel better. And we've seen, I, I didn't go to the store up here, so this is kind of looking like we don't get backup battery unless there's a store in one of these three jumps. Hmm. Pack three, I guess. I am not feeling that strong right now. Um. Uh, we are maxed on crew, so I don't want another mantis unless I want to replace a human. I think I'd rather just get scrap. Yeah, mantis for mantis. Uh, it's not all heavy laser shots. The uh, artillery is something else. They are. Seven one damage shots with a little bit of reach and fire chance, I think. You try to find a good part of your Hitman barn hunt video to make it into a short when you have the time. Where to send it and in which format. Um, the best way, if it's like the YouTube thing, is you don't have to clip it yourself. Send me a whisper on Twitch with the YouTube video timestamp. If you send me the YouTube video timestamp, I can go to the video and say, okay, it's here. Then I can go to Twitch and clip it myself. Or if you really want to 
be above and beyond, you find the Twitch VOD of it and tell me the Twitch timestamp. Although I think you might be able to clip it yourself if you find the the Twitch VOD. And if you clip it yourself, just tell me, give me the link to it, and then it's super easy for me to do. I do want to max this out. I feel like my upgrades are super freaking hard, far behind, man. God, why do I feel so far behind? I think this is going to be a really low scoring run. It would have been a double speed Vulcan, you're right. I didn't even think about that with the, uh, with the, uh, thing, Majigger. the augment that's super duper crazy fast. I did not even think about that. Deleted crew. Free engine upgrade with the human blue option. Uh, we got free power, didn't we? Or no, we got a low amount of scrap. I think that was actually not the ideal outcome. Oh well. Oh, we do get another store. Come on, backup battery. Come on, backup battery. Final store with systems, and it has three shitty things I can't get instead of the one thing I could have gotten. Thanks, FTL. Thanks for being shitty. Congratulations. You are successfully shitty. Enjoy your shitty day. It's pretty neat that the ship is just two long corridors to the front and back. Yeah. Honestly, this ship design reminds me of... Was it Cosmeteer? Where you build your own ship? And the some of the best weapons were those... Uh, what are those? Projectile particle accelerators this this is kind of like those particle accelerators along along the ship the rail guns yeah yeah like the uh cosmeteer rail guns that's what it reminds me of. it was really cool what are my thoughts on the weapon pre-igniter op very expensive usually not worth it if you're on hard mode unless you have a very particular build or a very far ahead oh, this guy's really space is really far away i'm gonna get one repair i guess Okay, what do I need? Lots of value points, power, and dodge. Start with power. Actually, I probably have enough drone parts. Let's get ship fights where we can. Worth more scrap than repaired. Jumps. Okay, trying to see if I can avoid using hacking. Screw that crap. Get effed, Iron Intruder Drone. Get effed. I fire every... Okay, uh... I hate Iron Intruder Drone so much, I'm firing literally, okay, not literally, almost everything at the drone control to get that crap offline. Good dodges, just enough dodges, perfect. Auto fire this. Get that drone out of here, man. Get it out. Get it out. That one's a little more okay. Still annoying. But if I could just turn that off, that would be great. Beautiful. Uh, in Cosmeteer, you could plop a crew, transporter walkway. Yeah, that'd be pretty cool to get our crew around. The, that would be perfect for these rock crew. Super slow getting around the ship. That would be pretty cool. 
Now, Teal, you just use the airlocks to get them places faster. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Here, get on this walkway. That's an airlock. Yeah, it's it's a it's a it's a, a walkway out the airlock. That's so hard to understand, human. Go. Get out. Nobody likes you. I mean, uh, have a nice trip. See you next fall. I right, hack these weapons. And I keep, I swear, it has been so long since I have a run where I never found backup battery. Every time I hit B, I'm so confused about why it's not working. We need a Sector 8 store with backup battery to actually... ...not be screwed by this no backup battery shenanigans. Honestly, um, with this augment, that makes everything charge twice as quickly, or half as long, however you want to say it. It feels like I basically have a bunch of um, Vulcans with how quickly everything charges. Kind of cool thing here you don't see often is being able to partially depower a weapon to use the power somewhere else then bring it back without losing charge yeah with how quickly they um, charge up I guess what do I think about some Cosmeteer on stream would it be interesting for you super fun I did stream it I don't have any plans to stream it anytime in the near future because uh, the single single player game is as fun as it is got a little very repetitive it feels like the game needs more stuff to do in it to be a fun single player game you hear it got expanded a bit? Well, I feel like the, the single player would need a lot more than just a bit of an expansion to really be something I would stream again. I, I, I would be happy to. I would just, it's gonna be a while before I do that. Right, value point, value point. Um, do you think we were going to accept another human? Did you hear how much the last one griped all the way down to the front of the ship? <laughs> Do I even need a drone part here? I don't think I do. No, I'm gonna just auto fire. I wonder how much, how good auto firing this would be. So if we auto fire our lasers, it's basically keeping a shields down for our artillery that's maxed out. Pretty good. Last you tried, Cosmeteer is a little more than just constructor ship, fight someone, upgrade, repeat. Yeah, that's 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 what I remember the game being. It was very fun. But uh it's kinda kinda one note. And I think I even maxed out the enemies and my ship value or something. Maybe not my ship value, but I think the enemies weren't getting any stronger by the end. I can't remember. From what you see in the patch notes, there's nothing significant content-wise, only balance and quality quality of life for Cosmeteer. Okay. Yeah, definitely potential. I would agree with that. Definitely potential for the game. Is there another Ion Intruder? Get out, man. Get out. Literally get out. Get out my ship. Hack it. Nice. Kill him before he can actually do anything. Perfect. This is about to fire. Never mind. Artillery to the rescue. Um... All right, 66 scrap, going in the boss fight. All but door value point, I'm kind of okay with that. Quick, take one power to O2 to put in my dodge when the missile comes online, because I don't have backup battery to put in the hacking like I normally would. So, we want a crew kill phase one, and we need our fire beam for that. So I feel like Ion Stunner, actually, Heavy Laser, Heavy Laser, Fire Beam for the first volley. One Heavy Laser into Missiles, one Heavy Laser into Shields, Fire Beam across 
missiles and shields. Hack the shields. Then we swap one heavy laser for an ion stunner so we can stun them in the fire in the shield room. While we go for the crew kill. That's the plan here. Kill all but one is ideal. Well, if you want to see the Cosmeteer playthrough, it's on YouTube, but I know it's different than watching the live stream. A lot of people prefer watching the live stream. Okay, that's annoying, but it's not my weapons. I'll take it. I know, 8 second fire beam is insane, right? Get some fires, boys. Beautiful. Iron Stunner auto fire. Beautiful. Okay. Ah, oh, if I had pre aimed, I could have fired the fire beam. Damn. We did hit his shield while he's cloaked. Nice. That is a lot of fires. You'll love to see it. Said uh, cloaking on fire and artillery if we can. Fuel bay down and on fire. Stun him in the... Oh, artillery, why? <laughs> Damn it. Oh, artillery, I forgot. I forgot. Artillery helped so hard that we didn't get all the crew kills we should have gotten. <sighs> okay. Yeah, we got a good number of crew kills. It's fine. It's fine. Artillery is too good at helping. Too good at helping. Alright, it's fine. Uh, last value point, I guess. Uh, we, we got a good number of crew kills still, right? It's pretty good, yeah. We could probably get a couple more of this, this, this phase, if we can... Damn it. I'm failing this, aren't I? I am. Okay, no missiles. This looks like we'll get some decent fires while stunned and shield still. Okay, there's one. Turn this down to level one here, that might help. Uh, cook now. Stop auto fire. Whoops. Okay. Oh, freaking dodged, man. Uh, I think I need a side room bug here. If I'm going to get any more crew kills, unless... This should work. Good. No more shots. No more shots. There. Now they should only board with one if I let that animation finish. Perfect. GG. Alright, well, not quite GG. One more. One more thing. One more, um... Phase to go. Who'd have thought? Basic Laser 2 would be a weapon good enough for Rand to not sell. <laughs> I would say it's less about... Uh, basic laser 2 being good and more about us only being able to get 4 weapon power. Uh, you just took a walk to the convenience store, still snowing? Oh gosh. Well, I'll, I'll be looking out the door once I get done to see if I'm going to try to even go work out or anything. Okay. 40 scrap gets me... Let's go power. I'm gonna say swag sensors, but I still don't have backup batteries, so. Alright, we should get the result and shield super duper fast with this build, I hope. 
Okay, my control, I don't have the counter. I didn't even plan for my control. Whoops. It's fine. Oh, nice, that made him leave. Perfect. Oh, it made him move to the cloaking? What? Weird. Alright, we don't cloak this for the overcharge. Wow. Wow, okay. Double fire in my OP artillery chat. Why would you do such a thing to my OP artillery? Go all in on that. I need him to not feel cloaking though. Don't fire. Cloaking is the last. Uh, we're off just at the wrong time, damn it. Okay, we got pretty good dodges though. All right, should do it. Artillery to finish. Oh, the dodges with nobody on piloting. What the hell? All right, final GG cookie time. The what was this ship called? The Boom. From Mr. Keese's uh, type death by Keese ship pack. The uh, that was the Fed F, I think. The Boom. GG cookie time. I have a feeling that was a low scoring run. Look at that. 4590. And that was on hard difficulty. Wow, what a low scrap run. We had two really low scrap runs, I feel like, uh, on RPG Nerdos and on this ship today. Um, you're not going to gym today. It's too, too cold and snowy and stuff. Yeah. Well, that was fun. We only went a little late, even with a multiverse run in. So I hope you all had a good time. You all kept me company as I avoided going out in the ice and snow. I'm going to have to decide if I'm going to try to go out and get some food tonight or just eat the one frozen dinner I have. So, as usual, usual, you all are amazing. Thank you to um, all the folks who sent us ships today. Mr. Key was, Keys was that one. Uh, RPG Nerdos and Tech Diff. Tomorrow we'll be playing FTL Harbor No Pause. Hopefully we won't have any weird weather things that make me unable to stream. Um, and then, of course, WoW Hardcore... Uh, classic on Wednesday, so love you too, chat. Uh, is it too late to be a pilot? Just just a little bit. But as usual, you all are amazing. Thanks for all the support, the bits, the follows, the subs, the gifted subs, lurking, hanging out, sending me ships, being awesome. All that stuff. I will see you all tomorrow for some hard mode no pause. So until next time, peace out, happy gaming. Y'all enjoy this sea shanty. See y'all next time. Later, my friends.